Hello everyone, and welcome to this Sunday's Gospel Reflection. A reading from the Gospel of Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus instructed the twelve as follows. Anyone who prefers father or mother to me is not worthy of me. Anyone who prefers son or daughter to me is not worthy of me. Anyone who does not take his cross and follow in my footsteps is not worthy of me. Anyone who finds his life will lose it. Anyone who loses his life for my sake will find it. Anyone who welcomes you welcomes me. And those who welcome me welcome the ones who sent me. Anyone who welcomes a prophet will have a prophet's reward. And anyone who welcomes a holy man will have a holy man's reward. If anyone gives so much as a cup of cold water to one of those little ones because he is a disciple, then I tell you most solemnly, he will most certainly not lose his reward. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. In today's Gospel passage, Jesus not only instructs his disciples on the importance of their allegiance to him, but also emphasises the significance of faith in action. He urges them to demonstrate their commitment through tangible deeds and hospitality towards others. Jesus teaches us that faith goes beyond mere words and beliefs. It requires active engagement. He encourages us to take up our cross to embrace the challenges and sacrifices that come with following him. It is in our willingness to endure and persevere that our faith truly shines. Jesus reminds us that our faith is reflected in how we treat others. He emphasises the importance of welcoming those who follow him, acknowledging that in doing so, we welcome him and the Father who sent him. Our actions of hospitality, kindness and acceptance towards fellow believers demonstrate our genuine love for Christ. Jesus highlights the significance of recognising and supporting the prophets and holy individuals among us by extending our care to those who bring God's message and embody his holiness. We not only receive their blessings, but also become instruments of God's grace in their lives. Even the smallest acts of kindness hold great value in God's eyes. Jesus tells us that even offering a cup of cold water to one of his disciples will not go unnoticed or unrewarded. This reminds us that our everyday actions can have profound impact on others and carry deep spiritual significance. As young individuals growing in faith, it is crucial to translate our beliefs into actions. Let us not be content with simply professing our faith, but let us actively live it out. We can do this by seeking opportunities to serve others, showing compassion to those in need and being a source of encouragement and support to our fellow students and members of our community. By engaging in faith in action, we become ambassadors of Christ's love and mercy in the world. Our actions have power to inspire and to transform, creating a ripple effect that extends far beyond ourselves. Through our deeds, we demonstrate our devotion to Christ and become beacons of hope and compassion to those around us. May this gospel ignite a fire within you to live out your faith boldly and authentically. May you strive to be agents of positive change, embodying the loving teachings of Jesus through your actions.